What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Platinum Walkthrough. Okay, so in the last episode we managed to get through the Orberg Mine, and now it is time to go into the Orberg City Gym, where the leader Rourke is waiting for us. You know, he's like, hey, you know, you need this and this to actually win. Now, if you talk to this guy, he, he he's already believing in us, saying that we're the champ to be and whatnot. He's telling us how to beat the Rock-type Pokemon. They do have weaknesses, which is grass type and water type, which we do have a grass type. It's just the only problem is, you know, it is slow. Now, early on in the into this recording, I did lose against Rourke, so I'm a little, I'm a little, I'm still a little pissed off about that because, uh, you know, when uh, when you when the Pokemon have status affecting moves such as you know Screech, Leer, and all that stuff, it does take its toll when they do it once or twice especially this early on right here which I probably paid for and uh, you guys will never ever 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 get to see because you know what I cut it out so I'm doing my little switch training right here with uh, Donatello Don Donatello and Hydra because we need to get Hydra back into uh, you know the big old Gyarados that it's supposed to be and luckily Donatello is using his quick uh, claw like a charm alrighty Alrighty, and there's that absorb attack. And uh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. Goodbye. Goodbye. And Hydra gained some experience points while not doing anything. And I'm I'm just like, you know, I'm thinking to myself, why in the hell did I pick Hydra again? I don't know. Probably because I missed my uh my Gyarados. Alright, so let's move on right here. We got another trainer, and this guy right here is gonna be telling us that only those who win can challenge the Pokemon Gym, which I mean, hello bro. Uh, do you see? Do you see what I just did there? Kick this butt! So here he comes out with the Geo dude and a Hydra number four. Not going to do anything at all. Not one thing. Nothing. So I'm just gonna switch it out right here. All right, switching out. Here we go. Donatello gonna take some damage because you know there's that tackle attack. And uh, well, here we go with an absorb attack. That's right, absorb the nutrients. That's right. Eat it, Geodude. Eat it. That's right. How about that? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, and uh, well, more experience points for Hydra number four because he's a lazy piece of you-know-what. And, uh, well, I'm going to be switching it up right here to Hydra number four because what's what's the what's the risk, man? I mean, I just admitted to, guy, to you guys that, you know, off-screen, I did, well, not off-screen, on-screen. You know, that kind of stuff. I did lose to, to Rourke, that a-hole. You'll see how I defeat him. It's going to be domination. Invoke my, uh, my my dominance on him. That's right. So here we go. Razor Leaf, hopefully for the win. But no, there's that tackle attack. How is it that Onyx is faster than a Steelix? Is it because Steelix is a Steel-type Pokemon and it's very, very heavy? I don't know. And uh, there we go. Buh bye Buh bye and Hydra grows to level 11, which is good. And uh, that is how you do the whole business right there. That is humiliating. It is humiliating for you because I just kicked your butt. You know, I'm just a beginner. Alrighty, so the next trainer right here is Rourke. And you guys are going to see the transition, like right now. And where, you know, I did lose to Rourke. So what I'm going to do right here is I'm actually going to be switching it up with Hydra to Donatello because that was my mistake right there. I did switch train with Hydra and this guy right here just took advantage of it including the Screech, Leer, whatever status effects uh, it does. So here it is guys, our very first gym battle in Sinnoh against Rourke, the rock type gym leader. This guy, look at him, he's like, I'm going to beat you down. And he comes out with a Geodude, just like every single Rock-type gym leader. And Donatello about to kick some butt. Major butt! So here we go. Using its Quick Claw. About to go use that Razor Leaf. Look at that. Razor Leaf for the win. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Say goodbye to Geodude right there. Look at that. It actually took me like quite a few minutes to beat Geodude. And uh, look at that. Donatello grows to level 17. And it wants to learn Curse. Now, on a regular Pokemon like a grass type or anything anything other than a ghost type Pokemon it will have different effects and I'm actually gonna use curse because it will actually uh, boost up its defenses now here comes out uh, here comes uh, uh, Onyx and uh, this guy this is the guy that really screwed with me because it used both stealth rock and screech 
And, you know, it, it just wasn't pretty. It wasn't pretty. Uh, I don't have any Pokemon that can defeat Rock-type Pokemon other than Donatello. And look at that. Donatello makes quick work. Mince meat! Mince rock meat. Oh, yeah. And uh, he's going to come out with a Cranidos. And this little bastard right here used his big old butt head just to beat me. I was not happy, guys. I was not a happy camper. So, here we go. He's going to use a headbutt. That's exactly what he beat me with. And I'm going to go with the Razor Leaf right here. Bam. Razor Leaf, hopefully for the win. Yes. Eat it, Cranidos. Eat it. That's right. Draven Corvone. Dominant as always. And it grows to level 7 or 18. You guys know what that means. You guys know what that means. Look at that. He's like, what? My buffed up Pokemon lost? Yes, sir, it did. They lost. And not only that, but her twig uh, is finally evolving. Now, I did lose to uh, I did lose to Rourke, but I, you know, you still get experience points during the battle. So I took that and I just came back and did this because you know that was his mistake right there. He let me lose with experience points. So here it is, guys. We got ourselves a Grottle. You know, it just grows up. They grow up so quickly, right? Alrighty. He's like, this is embarrassing. Went to a trainer. Gym badge, yada yada yada. I feel weak. Per uh, Pokemon League rules. Here you go. I'm gonna give you the cold badge. And there it is, guys. Our very first badge in this walkthrough. After a month. <laughs> My bad, guys. Yes, and uh, by getting the cold badge, you actually get the TM for uh, 76, which is Stealth Rock, and it enables you to, to use Rock Smash, which you know I think we're gonna get very very. Uh, I think we're gonna get that in, the, in just a little bit. I don't remember. So this guy's telling us that there are more gym leaders out there with different types. You should probably go battle them. That's probably what we're gonna do. And uh, yeah, your advice did not work, bro. I already had Pokemon. You know, I already have experience. Now, once you come out of the uh, the gym, you're gonna be feeling good, heavy, all that stuff because of a gym badge. So let's go ahead and take a look at that badge. I'm gonna click on this little bastard right here, and look at that, the cold badge. One down, seven more to go, including a bunch of other stuff right there. Okay, so stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we will be moving on in our adventure right here, finally. See you guys.